let's get started here. Um, what we're going to do today is we're going to uh, draw pictures using numbers. We're going to pick the number 5 today. So here we'll draw the number 5. Okay, that's a simple 5. Now we're going to go ahead and draw from this. We're going to try to build something from this. And you can look at this and you can see all sorts of different kinds of things. Um, let's see. Let's go ahead and we could play around with a lot of things. We could put a tail on it, right? And then we can make this a long neck, kind of a long, goofy head. And then all of a sudden, you get kind of a pot belly duck, right? So this is kind of silly. And he looks pretty happy. You know? And you put your little pond here and some bushes. See, and that was all done with the number five. Now, let's do something else with the number five. Let's see. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and do this again. We're going to go ahead and pick a number five. Now, what else can we draw with the number five? Let's see. Um, you know, you got to look at the number five and look at the shapes, and then you start seeing something in it. And so here's something that I've done this a lot in the past. And actually, I didn't make this up. I saw this is what what uh, I saw this once. I saw somebody do this once, and that's where I got the idea. So here we go. The number five suddenly becomes a roaring lion. Roar. <laughs> so that's a, that's a simple one, and it's a fun one to do. So you turn to number five. into a lion. So that's pretty cool. Alright, let's go ahead and write about the number two. There's a few things you can do with the number two. A lot of times, you know, the fun thing to try to think of first is maybe a face. Can you make a face out of this? And I think I can make a face out of this here. These kind of are like the eyebrows right here, right? We'll put the eyes. Just kind of build the eyes here. Right? Mouth. All of a sudden, I think I'm starting to see a smiling face here. There you go. See how simple that was? That was at the number two. Now let's try another number two. And, uh, you know, I've, I've uh, taught some classes on uh, art to some kids in, in schools. And and uh, one of the first ones I did, and one of the ones that all the kids seem to try to do and they like to do is this, this particular one. It's a snake in a basket. So this kind of works out to be the snake, and then this is the top of the basket. So what we do is first we start here. Come all the way around. And we put, I like putting big bubble eyes on stuff because it's just fun to put big bubble eyes. And it's a cartoon, it doesn't matter. You can do you can do crazy with a cartoon. So here we go. There's a snake, and then what we do is we make a basket. And we go like this. There's a snake, and you go, and there's this little forked tongue. And you know, you can do little things, you can decorate, you could put a lid on the basket, you know, like it just popped out. And you can do a guy with a flute over here, you can get real creative if you want. And you can just, you know, man in a 
the turbine. Blowing the flute. It's making that the snake come out of the basket. Anyway, that's all done from the number two, which is right there. Kind of scribbled on it. Get rid of it. All right, let's try something else. Let's see. What's another number? Yeah, let's do faces again here. This is a good one to do a face from. Number nine. Pretty simple. You just do the same kind of circle here. And then you can make a nose. Smile. And it looks like a guy with glasses, right? That's his ear. Once you do a few of these, you'll be able to come up with a bunch of your own drawings. Dang, there's the number nine. There's, it's funny because there's there's actually two different ways to make a four. So there's different things you can do with this, right? Um, let's see. Well, this is easy. You just close off all the parts. Kite, All right? As one, and then this four. Let's see what we could do with this four. Hmm. Well, I'm just gonna do something pretty simple. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, <laughs> turn this into. A window and there's going to be a little boy looking out the window at the kite he's in a house some clouds and some birds and he's stuck in his house and he's thinking you know what I'm gonna go outside and play look at that guy he's flying a kite that looks cool anyway when I, uh, go ahead and pick some numbers on your own get a piece of paper and a pencil and start writing numbers down and turning numbers into stuff you know have some fun with it you know go crazy so right here you got Another one, you know, here's someone you can go. It's a baby duckling. I know we already did a duck, but I saw a duck. Okay, I looked at the three and I saw a duck. So I made another duck. Alrighty, so that's the kind of thing I'm talking about. We can go on and on and on with this. But once you give that a shot, mess around, see if you can come up with some interesting things, and then let me know about it. Alright, thanks a lot. It's been fun.